Advancement has occurred, and we are now ready to complete chapter six of the um, chapter six of this book that will take us to the castle. So we're going to head forward and we're going to go on down the right path. Both paths really go the same way, but this one takes me over to a greater soul gem and the art of war magic. Which is a pushing destruction magic up to level 92. So we are definitely going to be looking at, very soon, the highest rank of fire magic. Destruction magic. But let's head forward. And into a tunnel we're supposed to enter, entering a tunnel. Here you are, Seekers. And, a, and I also see a, um, I see a word wall. So as soon as we put these things in their place, we'll have a look at that word wall. Let's head through some fire magic. No, let's, let's do it, let's get a word. The word of power, armor, dragon aspect. Let's make sure we've got that unlocked. So we've got strength and armor. We've got bend will equipped. Where's that dragon? Dragon. That's right. I am controlling a dragon. You can lock onto a nearby target and attack it with magic. You can also command the dragon to attack. Beware. Mirak is strong. He knew. Oh, this is so cool! Time for me and Mirak to go to Fizz. are you so easily swayed? He is indeed. He's my dragon now. No, not yet. We should greet our guest first. And so the first dragonborn defeats the last dragonborn at the summit of Apocrypha. No doubt, just as Hermaeus Mora intended. He is a fickle master, you know. But now I will be free of him. My time in Apocrypha is over. You are here in your full power, and thus subject to my full power. You will die, and with the power of your soul, 
I will return to Soul's time and be master of my own fate once again. Dragonborn versus Dragonborn. Let's do it. He got me with a lightning bolt. Crap. I was so close. I had him as well. That's what's so irritating. I could have finished him. Ready to fight him, I know I can beat him. Where am I? I'm inside chapter six, so I'm gonna ride the dragon again. I can live with that. Go dragon friend. We'll beat you. Beware. Mirak is strong. He knew you would come here. So Rota, are you so easily swayed? No, not yet. I will look we for a spot to land. And so the first dragonborn meets the last dragonborn at the summit of Apocrypha. To hit. I need to get my magic back up, magic back up quick. Extra magic, extreme magic. Who's 
I can't believe you're killing these awesome looking dragons. You monster. Salotha! No! He's an awesome dragon! Thank you! Thank you, Hermius! Get to Take him! To escape me, Mira! Yeah, you bastard! Nothing from me here! <laughs> I'm finishing him. No matter! I have found a new dragon born to serve me. <laughs> May he be rewarded for his service, as I am. Mira, harbor consciousness of rebellion of the mystery. No. Let's take the soul. Serve me faithfully, and you will continue to be richly rewarded. I got a dragon soul. That is good. That's good stuff. I'll unlock the dragon armor ability. Thing is, I now have more dragon bone than I know what to do with. Read the dragon book. And let's return to Solstein. That arse though, he destroyed the cool looking dragon. It wasn't like some noble dragon, but it just looked like some like really powerful beastly dragon. That's such a shame. Feel it. The tree stone is free again. The oneness of the land is restored. It's good, isn't it? Does that mean is it over? 
Is Mirak defeated? It was Mirak who threatened Solstein. With him gone. Tell me though. My father's death. Then, it was the Allmaker's will, as it said. One more thing, Skull friend. If you will. I know it is not my place, but may I offer a word of advice? You can offer it. I probably won't accept it, but go ahead. As shaman of the skull, I am charged. While you are not of the skull, Hermamora forced you to serve him in order to. The Allmaker made you dragonborn for a high. Walk with the Allmaker, skull friend. Okay. Now what? Oh, you're the blacksmith. Use your dragon bow. The weapons of the skull. Take a look. Seriously, I need to get rid of some of these bones. You'll buy dragon bone. Awesome. I've got too much for you, but what's heavier, the bones or the scales? Oh, the bones, definitely. So let's pick up 11, 11 grand's worth of gold. All right. So I'm going to end this episode here. In the next episode, we'll probably look around some more in Solstheim. But I'm going to see what else I can find off camera first. So thank you guys for watching and see you next time for more of Skyrim. Peace.